channel. I'm Ebony. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you guys are doing well, staying safe, and all of that good stuff. I hope you're doing mentally okay. It's a lot going on, but hopefully this video can take your mind off things for a few minutes. You know, I'm going to try not to be long-winded because I know sometimes I can ramble on and I suck at editing. So, you know, my bad. <laughs> Sorry if you hear my baby back there snoring, as always. I don't ever get to do videos till late at night. My husband's downstairs playing video games. Kids are asleep, and I just bring him up here with me. So, yeah. So I can get some things done during my me time. Or it's our us time, I guess. Yeah, so like I said, I have a lot of things going on. And, yeah, so I'm just going to get through it. This video is about lock products, but I'm just going to throw a few other things in here that I've picked up along the way that I think my lock family would be interested in. Maybe, maybe, maybe not, but you know, I didn't want to do a separate video. And plus, I miss y'all, you know, yeah, I hope y'all missed me too. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So like I said, I don't want this video to be like 30 minutes long. All right, so as y'all know, all of the shops are shut down. The beauty supplies are closed. <sighs> yeah, I think I said something about it in my last video. I really, I don't even remember what my last video was, but in the last video, I know I picked up some lock gel from CVS that was a mess. So I drove all around the CPSs and my area since that's the only thing that's open. We have Meyer. I really didn't think about Meyer till till later on actually. And I wasn't doing Walmart because you have to stand in line and get into Walmart. So yeah, so anyway, I picked up some bull crap from, from CVS and my hair turned out terrible. <laughs> so um I actually found somebody on Instagram who actually happens to be local and she posted a video of my favorite not a video but a picture of my favorite lock gel i i screamed for joy because like i said i literally couldn't find it anywhere and my hair had just turned into this big frizz ball with that stuff that i use so yeah i didn't care how much it was i'm like just give it to me i sent her a message immediately so yeah so she had that and she had a bunch of other things on her site um okay i know i said a long story short. i mean i wasn't gonna be long but all right sorry y'all told y'all i'm long-winded sometimes so <sighs> okay so over the past couple of weeks i had an allergic reaction to something it started out with my scalp well, no, actually it was my arms. My arms was just itching, bumps just everywhere. And then my scalp just felt inflamed. So I thought it was the shampoo. First, I thought it was the shampoo that I used. Um, But then it's like, like I said, my whole body just started breaking out. So yeah, it was a mess. It was like uh, dry patches all in my hair. And I'm scratching it and it's just, oh my God, it was a mess so i don't know if it was my if it was just an all over allergic reaction to something and I, what i think it was was um i was drinking them dang on <laughs> five hour energy drinks and then i was taking excedrin and drinking coffee so i think i might have had a little bit too much <laughs> caffeine in my system and i think my body just kind of reacted to it so <sighs> yeah all right so with that being said she had this um soap from design essentials peppermint and aloe soap shampoo i keep saying soap so i shampooed my hair yesterday and like i said she had the gel too shampooed my hair yesterday i used this twisting my hair with this my scalp feels so much better oh my god i'm gonna make sure i keep this in the house so this is the peppermint and aloe uh 
Therapeutics Anti-Itch Shampoo. Yep, so I use this. And like I said, she uh, was selling my favorite lock gel, which is the Talia Waji Tight Hold. And then I thought that it was the um, the smaller. Let me see, do I have it? No, but I don't have it with me, but I have a smaller container of this just to compare the size. Because I think she was charging like 15 for this, I believe. And I looked on Amazon, I looked everywhere, and people was charging $15 for a small size. So, anyway, I picked up two of these. So, we're good. Hopefully, we're good until they open things back up. <sighs> then I went to my uh, local Meyer and they had the cream of nature. So, I picked up a backup for that just in case we run out. <sighs> I'm sorry, y'all. I talk too much sometimes, okay? <laughs> and I also use this in my hair. It's the Twist and Set Setting Lotion. Yes. This is about to become a staple in our house. Yeah. I was about to say something about that. I forgot what I was about to say, but whatever. Then we have this um, from Design Essential also. She sell all of this stuff. If I can remember, I'm going to put her name down at the bottom, but <clears throat> excuse. Oh, it's on this. Hold on one second. I'm going to tell y'all her name in case y'all need to order some stuff. If y'all watching this and y'all ran out of lock stuff, lock, pro I keep saying lock stuff, lock products or just hair products, period. She have other things that she offers. So, yeah, we have the Rosemary and Mint Stimulating Super Moisturizing Conditioner. I don't know if you can see it. I wanted to try this, but with everything that was going on on my scalp, I didn't want to use too much. So I just used the shampoo, the lock gel, and the um, setting lotion. That was it. But I'm looking forward to trying this. Let me see what else we have in here. Oh, and this is her, uh, her shop name. Locks of Love 360. I know this ring light, it may be hard to see it. So yeah, this is a moisturizing spray with water, aloe vera, sweet almond, sunflower, and vitamin E oil. So she makes this and packages this herself. And she also has another, um, is it a growth oil I believe she has on her site? I'm not sure, but you can check it out. Like I said, oh, and she does beautiful, beautiful locks i haven't been to a shop in forever but whenever i do start back going to a shop or start going to a shop period she's one of the first people that i want to go see because yeah she just does an amazing job she's in michigan located in the um De metro detroit area so she's in ferndale so if you're in the area check her out her name is uh on Instagram locked by Bianca, I think is her name, but I'll put it, uh, yeah, I'll put it in the description box. Yeah, she does a good, good job. And since I'm shouting out local people, let me give a shout out to my eyebrow lady who I can't wait to go see. I'm stalking her Instagram page, waiting on her to open up the books. Her page name is Brow Beats and Lashes beautiful brows and beautiful lash lash extensions check her out and also i'm waiting on the tattoo shop to open up my favorite place to go to is bloodline dynasty in farmington hills michigan it's a shop with a young, a lot of young black tattoo artists uh the, the shop the whole vibe in there is just yeah it's just everything so check them out okay so next okay i'm about to breathe through these things because i spent a whole lot of time talking about that but this is a lock video so <laughs> yeah all right y'all so the next thing that i got that i'm excited about i just been shopping because i've been stuck here in the house so just been doing a little bit of online shopping trying to support some of these 
some smaller um, companies the, the best way I can. I ain't got a lot of money, but you know, so I'm just picking up things here and there. So the next, the next thing I got was this actually a grocery bag since we can't do anything to go to the grocery store. So it's a reusable grocery bag and this is actually my first time seeing it. Oh, it's so beautiful. Look. It says tats and snacks. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> Ooh, nice and big reusable grocery bag. So the grocery store around for me uh, is uh, well, we have Kroger, some other things, and I feel like I'm always there. And so we have plastic bags, too many plastic bags. So I'm looking forward to going to the grocery store and getting this. I just got to make sure that I don't uh, put junk in it. So because the lady who uh, actually make, make these bags and sell them, her name on Instagram is Afrohemian, I believe is her name. Oh, Lord, I know I keep saying beautiful, but that's just a word I like to use to describe things. Beautiful young lady. She has beautiful locks. They're actually green. Her whole style, her whole vibe is just dope. It's just, it's everything. Just go check her out. Her name is Afrohemian on, uh, Afro, I think that's her name on Instagram. She uh, does a lot of vegan recipes. She's an author. She sells uh, cups, mugs. Her picture is just, like I said, the whole vibe of her page is just, just everything. So yes, yeah, so these are reusable grocery bags. So, so I'm happy to have that. The next thing that I picked up were these nose rings from an Etsy shop. Lord, I don't know. Look, I'm gonna see if y'all can. Oh, y'all can't see these. They're so small. Oh Lord, I'm gonna try to cut this out if I can. But the bag is so tiny. Look, I just show it to y'all like this. Look, can you see? These three nose rings. So, this is the name of the shop. They have beautiful jewelry on there. The name of the shop is this. Midnight's Mojo on Etsy. Gorgeous nose rings. I had too many in my uh, basket. I had to narrow it down to three. So, I'm like, okay, Ebony, slow down. You, you ain't got money like that. So, chill out, sister. So, those are the three that I started with so I have a um a stud with three okay I got it open with the three stones this is the stud with the three stones excuse my ugly nail polish too y'all know the nail shop's not open so <laughs> we on the struggle bus then I got this pretty hoop and they have these in different colors. Yep, they have different colors. You can get silver with just all kind of different combinations on there. Then this braided hoop. Yep, so I got those. And like I said, I got that off Etsy. The next thing that I got is from Another um, one of my favorite Instagram people, Miss uh, Empress AK. <laughs> so her um, her jewelry page is Empress Finds. This is her. Yep, her Instagram uh, information. And she has a lot of gold unique finds. So these are what I picked up. 
set of earrings. Now, I don't know where I'm going to take them to, but I feel like I need to do a photo shoot or something with these, <laughs> with these earrings. Just gorgeous. Gorgeous. I love gold. Gold is my thing. And it's so crazy because I picked out my wedding ring, but I, I was thinking I should have picked out a gold one. <laughs> But I wanted something that was kind of antique looking. So, yeah, special to me. So, but all my other jewelry will be gold. I have to get a gold necklace for my um, little niece. Her little ashes is in a little heart. And um, I took it off when I went to get an x-ray. And I haven't been able to get it back on. And uh, I feel incomplete without it. So, yeah. That's next on the list of things to get. So the next thing that I got are these um, brass bangles by this lady right here. Sierra sells one. They come in this pretty little drawstring bag. And then she offers all like sets of brass and gold bangles so you can make create your own different stacks so then she has this one where you can get it engraved this one says queen i actually have one that's should be on the way and i got my name engraved in it so should say ebony hopefully it'll be here soon so these and then you can get nice simple ones she has um i think she has uh silver ones and um also like more antique looking ones so you can just go on the site and just go see you know what suits you if this is something that you're interested in and these were inexpensive i think these are about um these thinner ones were about five dollars a piece and these thicker ones were about ten dollars a piece yep you just make make a stack Ooh, if i can get it on my hand okay i can't get them all on my hand now but yep so these are going to be like my everyday jewelry i'm not a big um accessory person i just get one thing that i like and i stick with it so this is going to be that. So I'm going to pick up, actually pick up some more of these. So I got these just to wear on one hand. Then my other, yeah, on one wrist. And then I'm going to get some more for this wrist. But I got other things for this wrist. And I'm going to show y'all that in a second. But yeah. So that's these. You know, I just keep them on for the rest of the video. So the last thing I got, I feel like it's something that I'm missing. No, that's it. All right, let me hurry up. So the last thing that I picked up is, I don't know if you guys are into healing crystals, but that's something that I'm into. Excuse me, that I'm into. I told you I just took my couch out of here so I can set up my whole little meditation station over there so i'm trying to get it together so yeah so i picked up um a few things from uh, another etsy seller this is her etsy name and these right here are palo santo like incense sticks so they're a little different from the traditional palo santo because you just like these like an incense and then they just burn unlike the other ones where you have to keep lighting it to get it to go so picked up these and then she has some sage sticks but she also had um some pretty excuse me excuse me she had a, a whole different variety she's always putting different things on her etsy page so I highly recommend her stuff is amazing quality. 
So I said these sage sticks, she has some ones with flowers on them. I wanted to get them, but I was trying to stick with, stick with my budget. And so we had those sage sticks and then as far as, okay. Then we had these bracelets. This is what I said I'm going to be wearing on my other wrist. My mom actually gave me this one today. I was at her office and I was like, oh, where you get that bracelet from? She's like, you want it? I said, yeah. And she gave it to me. But I believe we got this when we went to the uh, the Boston Tea Room. She probably just forgot. So, yeah, I got these two bracelets. I was trying to, um, and then I also got some more stones. Now, I'm like a newbie when it comes to the crystals. I have one set up there by my picture frame i had those for a while and i i really do like them but they're smaller and so this is my second round so i don't know the names right off the bat but i just know when i was picking off the site i went with the ones that uh that were speaking to me you know since it's not like at the store where you can go in and feel them and touch them and you know see which ones you vibe with but uh from the description, these, the ones that I picked are the ones that I vibe with. So the bracelets that I have are Tiger's Eyes and was, I tried to write down some notes. I'm not really a good note taker, but just wanted to try to uh, give y'all some information. But so I have Tiger Eye and the Tiger Eyes to help you focus on your goals, stay committed, uh, stay committed to your goals into uh let's see into calm a wandering busy mind which is me the gemini the thinker my mind is always going <laughs> and then we have the black obsidian and this is to protect against evil i mean not evil protect against negativity it's also for grounding and balancing your root chakra or chakra i you pronounce it but you do with them what you want to do with them. So, yeah. Oh, those look cute. So I want to get a few more to go right here. And then that's just, yeah, that's just what it's going to be. So then I got this, this amethyst cluster. And that's so pretty. And then the amethyst is just, you know what? I'm not even going to sit here and, and lie to y'all, but <laughs> like I know all of these things by heart, but I know the amethyst is to, uh, they say you can sleep with it under your pillow to give you like a peaceful uh, night's rest. It's supposed to be like a, what is it? I can't remember. But all of the ones that I have that I picked out are to, um, help focus bring in a positive energy keep the negativity away and also this um i know everybody know about the rose quartz it's to bring in love and good vibes and all of that stuff and we definitely need it during these times so yeah i got this one the rose quartz then we have the clear what is this the clear smoky quartz and i think this one is to help you kind of be in the moment which is something that i kind of can do but then i can stray away <laughs> a lot of the times then we have the Oh, this is the one that I really was looking forward to. The uh, Blue Appetite. I think I pronounced that right. Now, this one is to help manifest your goals, clear confusion, and connect spiritually. And it's for a whole bunch of other things, but this one really spoke to me. <sighs> yes. It's hard for me to stay committed. I have so many ideas, but I get started on something and I start wandering off to the next thing and then everything just goes out the window that's just like my room i started doing my room but then i just started doing something else then i clean out 
one room then start on the next project so i have a hard time finishing and following through so that's why i picked this one and then i think that is it that's it i know i didn't really give you guys too much information about the crystals but you can go on to her site and you can you know go in there and see what speaks to you you know if you're into that sort of thing so i'm gonna sit here and do my research and see what each one of these are actually really about but like i said it's for you to put your own intentions into them and make them do what you want them to do all right all right and that's it hopefully you guys will check out some of these people uh not some of these people but some of these um shop owners that i mentioned you know at least just go get a page or follow and just see what they're about because all these people i've been following for a long time and i'm so happy to be able to support yes once again i hope you guys are doing well staying safe and if you stuck around this long could you please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it all right I'll be back soon with another video. See you guys later. Bye-bye.